11 o'clock. Uh, I would like to say I've just got up. It's Saturday morning and I've just got up. Wouldn't that be great? I haven't done that since I was about 15. <laughs> but anyway, uh, my husband is over his dad's house, the one that we're selling. Um, he got up about... I woke up at 5 to 4. Uh, five to five and uh, couldn't get back to sleep but it was okay because he was getting up at six anyway because he wanted to leave to seven to go over because it's the other side of London because um, he wanted to go over there and just do some you know turn the heating on or off or up or down or do something to the heating system um, and just check the house make sure everything's okay and rah rah so he left at seven to go and do that he's not back yet um, I then I basically got up at about half seven and had my shower, this and that, and I had uh, some emails to write and um, catching up with some admin stuff because it's been busy all this week. had a couple of parcels to pack for eBay, um, uh, a return that someone, I ordered something for Christmas so it's turned up broken so I had to sort that out and I went to the post office. And then I've just come back and I'm eating an omelette, just about to cook an omelette. Um, and then we'll be going shopping and just food shopping. And we've got to go and pick up the tiles. We've got to go and be in queue. And I think that's it. And that's probably going to be my lot today because I have got a splitting headache. I've taken two paracetamol, so um, I always feel guilty at the weekend if I don't do anything. But really, I'm running around all week. I should should be off the weekend but it's just so much to do I mean I know we've, the painting's got to be finished in there and that room still that room still leers at me every day so well see how I get on if my headache clears up later on um, I'm not too tired from all the running around and shopping and everything um, I might do some if not it'll be tomorrow at least I'll get something done all right I'll see you later I'm gonna make me an omelet so we're off Shopping, got the list, got my 84p voucher, which runs out today. I love it when you manage to use it before it runs out. And pets at home, I've got a damn big dog food. Windy! Proper windy. Right, dog food. Dog. Three for 20, might I forget. Junior. Oh, well, I always do that. Why don't they put it in the same place? <laughs> Three, senior. Are you going to get him senior? No. Three for 20. Not getting fish. Three for 20. Not getting fish. Right, so turkey. Turkey, lamb, and duck. Did you get your duck before? Three for 20 is quite good if they're £9.49 normally. Or they've got the price up. No, that's not a small dog. We ain't getting in one of them this year because it'll only hide it. Well, this is where we got him the fox. Oh, yeah, look. We've still got a fox in nine quid anyway, so we'll only have to get that and a packet some treats. Yeah. They've got a duck. <laughs> it's the toys, they're addicted. Um, they've got a duck. I don't know, the fox is really good though, isn't it? No, that's too, it'll kill that instantly. These 
these are by Wainwrights as well. They've only really got the fox or the duck. Mm -hmm. So whether you get him another fox, which he loves, but he's nearly murdered. He won't know the difference, so for us, don't get him a fox on it. For us. <laughs> They've got two different types of duck. They've got rough, tough mallard or tiger print, like a flying duck. Hello. Hello. Hello, Chinchilla. Hello. Hello. Hmm. Chinchilla, two for two hundred pounds. Lives for twenty years. Ah, oh, it's fluffy. Expensive though. This is Rana. Make you feel broody. Where did he go? He just disappeared. pile of them. That man, that man wasn't very happy, was he? Roller, wood file, curtain rod. No, not this one. <laughs> I don't want to go down that aisle again. Matt, we agreed, didn't we? Yeah. Why is, what's the difference between that one and the one underneath it? They look the same. They are, and the same price. Well, yeah, but the packets are different. Yeah, yeah they are. Look. Well, it's only got colours on it. Yeah. It's uh, walls and ceilings, that's interior walls and ceilings, low odour. They're obviously just different. This one's low odour. I think they both are low odour. I think it's just that one's old packaging and one's Helps new. Helps disguise surface imperfections. Mm. Yeah, they're the same, aren't they? They're just one's old packaging, I think. No. Uh, possibly.
Not on that pallet, are they? No, I didn't. Like grey. I'm gonna have a look. Quick. Oh, let's have a look. We could have got them when we were doing our thing. Well, they look straighter than Ricky's uh, building work, don't they? I don't know what they are. Yeah, I guess they're tiles. Right, come on. Yeah, well, I'm dreading that they're going to take up a whole pallet like this. Are they? It's the green boxes. Oh, I was going to say, the rest aren't. <laughs> Unless we get them for free, then we'll have them. Oh, just like Time, isn't it? Thank you, done. Dog food done. Car in front of us is stalled just as it's time to go. Oh, come on, no Mr. Lights. What a shit. Mm -hmm. saying sorry. Um, so he's carrying around around about, so yeah. in the wrong lane. You're going to cut someone up, aren't you? Um, Try. Otherwise it's stalled Dog food done, car is done, B&Q done, tiles done, safe is left.
snow is falling. Taking Stevens, did you hear it? Oh. Oh. Got to pick your pizza. I'll go off and get the rest of the stuff while you're debating. sad because it sounds all Christmassy, right? Mm -hmm. I don't want to go up and be all Christmassy, but we can't go up and be all Christmassy because it's still up in the air. Squeeze it between your legs. See if we get, because sometimes they do. I'll have a look on that stuff. supermarket so and I'm gonna do a haul why not because it's here ready to go so dishwasher salt for the dishwasher paracetamols for my headache <laughs> obviously um, had to get a stationary because it's just like the law um, and I've been really good and not bought any for ages but I, I've got a purpose for this one so I wanted it um, dog treats 
and also there's dog food down there, uh, which we got from Pet Plus. Salsa, salsa, um, tortillas, French stick, which my husband's going to have for lunch now, potatoes, uh, sweet, sweet, parsnips, cucumber, carrots, lettuce, cauliflower. Um, this was the last two. Look, we well, ended up having to go late because of um, uh, uh, just because by the time my husband came home from his dad's. But anyway, so two four pints of milk, turkey mince, chicken breasts, chicken strips. These are lovely if you coat them in bread crumbs and fry them up. Um, pizza. It's thin and crispy, spicy, whatever it is. That's not. That's for husband. He eats pizza. I don't. Breaded goujons. Again, husband, not me. Um, this is this is what I'll eat in the week. This is what he eats. Um, this is going to sound really like we spoil our dog. This is chicken for the dog. Um, we don't usually get this one. We usually get the. Um, Cheap chicken, as we call it. You know, the one in Sainsbury's, which is, um, it's the basics range or whatever, but it's still British chicken. It's still, you know, it's not been flown over from Thailand. We don't buy British food. I don't believe in food miles. Um, and it's it's good chicken, reasonably priced, because it's only for the dog. Um, but they didn't have any because we were late, so we got this one, which my husband will also have any sandwiches. We bought this for his sandwiches. And he bought that because he likes that. Um, Anchor spreadable, whatever that is. He has that in sandwiches. I don't have it. And some jacket, frozen jacket potatoes. I have. I do eat those. So that's it for the week. Um, oh, did I miss the eggs? Eggs. Two packets of eggs. Um, yeah, I only just realised we've always bought these so organic free range um, that I didn't realise there was RSPCA assured and everything as well, which is good. It's definitely our favourite eggs. So, yeah, that's it. Gonna put it all away now. Just got in. I've still got my coat on. The tiles are still in the car. Oh, I'll try my one of those was broken. Anyway, let's put this away. So. So back from shopping, shopping's all been put away. Um, it's four, uh, ten past four, ten past four. So um, we didn't actually end up going shopping till about 12, which is much later than we normally go out. We normally go out for food shopping. We normally go out about 9.30, 10 at the latest. So, and then we hate going at 12. So we decided to do the food shopping last and go and get the tiles and the B&Q and the pet shop and all that kind of stuff um, and then we went to the supermarket after got all our weekly food as you saw putting away it's four o'clock it's Saturday we're done we're calling it quits for today um, yes we know there's lots to do we know we've got to be painting that we know there's a room to be sorting out upstairs but it's Saturday it's four o'clock we've been on the go since seven it's a full day still so we're sitting down, we're watching crap television and we're just we're eating fresh bread and well I don't eat fresh bread but <laughs> my husband's got a fresh French stick and with stuff in it and I'm having um, chips and cheese which is my naughty food, my treat food, my Saturday treat food. So uh, and we just both sit down and uh, watch rubbish television. So you know, strictly come dancing and uh but that's probably it to be on Doctor Who. So yeah, I'm going to go and sit, watch, chill, that kind of thing. So I shall catch you tomorrow, Sunday, when tomorrow we will be hospital visiting, painting. I think that's it. It's mainly painting, getting that ready for the tiles. We've got to bring the tiles in. That was fun and games. They weighed really a lot. The car was going home like a Flintstone car. Um, but it's done now. They're here now all but one box one box broke on the pallet so that should be in on Wednesday which is cutting it fine for the tiler but 
What can you do? All right. I shall see you tomorrow. Bip, bip. Thank you.